What is up guys, Call Me Bond right here, back with another video, and I have not uploaded in the past three weeks because of things, and because of of this glorious PC I built in under $400, and it can run all the fucking games I want, including <gasps> Among Us, including oh Dolphin Emulator, oh! including... You heard that right, we're going back to Destiny 2 with low settings, that's right, you heard that right, we're going back to Destiny 2 with low settings. But, let's get straight into the video, and I'm going to teach you guys how to install Super Smash Bros. Melee on your computer, and it comes with rollback netcode, so you can play with anyone around your region, or technically around the world with Wi-Fi or LAN cable, LAN cable more preferably, but you get the point. Let's get straight into the video. So the first thing you want to do is go to the website called slippy.gg slash netplay slash netplay, I mean, and you're going to download this version of Dolphin emulator, which is which basically allows you to play melee, but with rollback netcode and it's OD as fuck. All right, let's just say that right now. It's OD as hell. One of the best things I've ever played. Tested it like millions of times, and you're gonna want to download it. And since I already have it downloaded, I'm gonna go ahead and pull it up for you guys. So technically, you're gonna have to unzip it. This is for Windows, by the way. Um, you're gonna unzip it. And you're gonna get brought up with all of this shit, all right? You're gonna get all of this shit brought up. And then you're gonna, of course, click this one, put it somewhere, for example, like your desktop, or like I have it on my hot bar right here. And it's pretty fucking OD, all right? It's, it's not that bad. It's only like 20 megabytes. It's not that bad. So once you have all of that downloaded, make sure you open it, of course, and. If you don't have a Super Smash Bros. Melee ISO, go in the description down below. You'll need it for sure. Um, make sure you have a good, reliable computer that can run, of course, Melee at 60 FPS or else it's stock shit. Um, other than that, you got Melee installed onto here. Make sure it's not from a shady website. Okay, if you downloaded your shit and it's from a shady website and you don't trust my link, uh, be careful, all right? But my link is usually secure and safe. All right. So once you have your Super Smash Bros. Melee set up, make sure you configure your settings because then you're going to fuck up your shit. All right. Uh, like I did, just put your paths in like I do right here. And then if you if you have like a lower end PC, that's like it's not like as bad as mine, but like worse, a little bit worse than mine. I suggest enabling CPU clock overdrive and turning that down at least to like a reasonable like 50% or less. Other than that, it should run perfectly fine. Um, your graphics also matter because you don't want the worst shit, you know. Like I have an adapter. It's not technically an adapter. It's just your graphics card. And then it basically uses mostly your... This emulation just basically uses a whole bunch of CPU. So, it doesn't really need much, in my opinion. Maybe the anti-aliasing, if you want to make it look better, doesn't really affect it. Your controller, I'm not sure about Wii remotes and GameCube adapters. It should say on the slippy.gg slash netplate in the link in the description. Um, how to and, like set those those up. In case you're gonna be playing with those, I don't understand if you want to be playing with that. Like, I mean, I don't know why would you would play with a Wii remote. That is just weird, in my opinion. But okay, um, it's usually gonna be set to GameCube adapter for Wii U. If you're playing by yourself, go ahead and set that either to to standard controller. Make sure it's to all of them, or I think it's just the two of them. I'm not sure because I don't really go online that much and then you're gonna configure your shit like I do don't mind about the giant dead zone I have a controller that's drifting and make sure all your buttons work make sure all your joysticks work and you're basically set to go make sure you also save your profile for this shit because it's gonna be useful 
and then good shout now you're ready to play super smash bros melee on the good shit all right melee! as you can see there's a login you can log in if you want but it's gonna bring you up to this page right here since i don't have it ready since i don't have myself ready and shit i don't fucking go on it so but it works perfectly fucking fine my dude. Like, you, you get all the characters and i think they updated the practice mode i'm pretty sure why the fuck did i go to all star um basically it, it's really it's really like it's actually good now with my brand new computer i can actually stream this if i really wanted to but i wouldn't risk it but yeah that's how you guys set up your super smash bros melee using slippy rollback net code it's old oh, as fuck and yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys like subscribe and turn on those turn on those post notifications for more dragon ball fighters or related content Challenge peace out gone.